Hello, in this tutorial we are going to create a very quick motion path animation in Autodesk Maya 2016. So what we'll do is create a curved line and we'll get a sphere to uh, follow that curved line as part of an animation. First thing we'll do is create the curved line. So we'll click on Create, Curve Tools and CV Curve Tool. Then basically um, if you haven't used the CV Curve Tool before, you just click where you want it to start and click where the next curve is going to be. You just keep clicking one by one to create a curved line. Okay, something just like that. All right, click on the um, arrow key, sorry, the select tool, or click on, hit enter on your keyboard, and that will end that curve. So either hit enter on the keyboard or grab the select tool and that will finish the line. All right, next thing that we'll do is we'll create the sphere. So we'll go create uh, NURBS primitives and sphere. <clears throat> and just move that around a bit. Now, what we want to do is we want to start it down here at the end of the line. We want it to move along this curve and finish up around about here. <clears throat> so what we'll do is just Grab the snap to curve tool. So we click on snap to curves. And now you'll see rather than in the middle, if I turn that off again, you have a little blue square here. If you turn it on snap to curves, that turns to a little blue circle. Using the move tool, grab that little blue cir circle and it should snap it to the nearest curve. All right. Now I'm moving it with the move tool and um, you can see it's snapped to that curve. So it's just moving along that curved line. All right. So then you can turn off snap to curves. All right, next thing to do is hold down shift and select both your sphere and the CV curve. And you need to change your menu set to the animation menu. Click on constrain, go down to motion paths and click on the little option box next to attach to motion path. <laughs> okay, make sure start end is selected. You choose a start time, which is the first frame, and an end time. So we'll make this across um, maybe 50 frames. So enter in 50. Everything else, just leave it as it is. Click on apply and close. All right, now you can see on this curve here that now there's a one down the end here on this end where the um, sphere begins, and there's a 50 on the other end of the curve. And that's where the sphere will end. So if you click on play, you can see the sphere go along that uh, line. And you can scrub backwards and forwards and see how the sphere follows that curve across 50 frames. So we've got first frame, it's moving across and it ends on the 50th frame at the end of that curve. Okay, that is a basic, basic motion path animation in Maya. Thanks for watching.